Okay, we just got our prime design ladder. I'm gonna unbox this thing and then we're gonna put it together and throw it on the van. Let's go. Okay, we've opened the box. The next step is, which is always step number one, throw away the instructions. Number two, set all your parts out so you know exactly what you have and if the manufacturer sent you everything they needed to send you. I was totally joking when I said throw these away. I have no idea what I'm doing. Now we have all of the pieces that we need to put on here. This looks pretty simple. I'm just gonna read the instructions real quick and then we'll get to it. So the first step is to install the top brackets on the top of your ladder. This might get a little confusing, so this might help. These ones are your bottom brackets. First thing you wanna do is bolt these all the way in. The second thing you wanna do is torque it to 90 pounds. It comes pre-installed like this. You just have to back this bolt all the way off and then reinstall it once you've slid this through the bottom bracket. They tell you to do 10 inches. And you can see right here, this is almost blocked completely and I'm not able to swing this all the way open. So we decided that two inches away from the middle of the door is the best place for this ladder. You can still reach through and grab your handle and you can open your door all the way around. Okay, just to show you guys what I'm talking about, I'm gonna do it at like two inches and you're gonna see the difference of the door I don't know if you can see it, but it literally has probably an inch and a half in between the van and the ladder. Okay, now that we've hung the ladder up and we've made sure that it's right there where we want it on that two inches, we're gonna go ahead and tighten the top locking bracket nut on the top. There's a bolt in the nut on the top. Tighten that guy so that our bracket doesn't move at all. I was gonna try to do this without a ladder. Just use a ladder, it's way easier. Once you got everything somewhat in place and a little bit snug, you're gonna go ahead and tighten the interior lug nuts or the interior, not lug nuts. You're, you're gonna tighten the interior carriage bolts. Okay, the next thing that we're gonna tighten is this right here. So we're gonna do this on both sides, but we're gonna start on this side first. Once you've done that, you're done. So you've gone through all the steps with me to put this ladder up. I think it looks really good. It is way more inexpensive. I say way more, but it's probably about three to $500 less expensive than some of the other racks. So I think it looks fine and I don't have to drill into the van. That's great. I can take this ladder off whenever I want. So I'm super pumped that you guys came along with me and built this ladder. Right now, this is post COVID in 2022. Uh, it's about $799 for the black one. They do make an aluminum one that is $100 less. So the link is down below. I do get an affiliate from it. Would love your support. If you guys don't want to get it from them, there are a couple different places that you could get it, but you're going to be paying for shipping. It's always the trade-off, right? So COVID actually brought those prices up quite a bit. This used to be a $500 ladder and that's what I bought it for. Yes, I have had this ladder for over a year. <laughs> hey, uh, thanks for sticking around guys. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and consider doing so. And remember guys, create what you love. We'll see you on the next one.